the Costa Concordia is preparing to make its final voyage. An Italian-American consortium in charge of the salvage operation has already righted the luxury liner, which ran aground off the Italian island of Giglio in January 2012. It's now preparing to refloat the vessel. The first stage involves anchoring and stabilizing the ship using cables to attach turrets to the vessel and stop it from slipping along the seabed. Next, a false bottom was created by filling the empty space between the rocks on which the wreck was resting with cement-filled bags. Six platforms, three large and three small, were then mounted. Metal tanks designed to act as floats were welded to the port side and filled with water. The vessel was then slowly hoisted upright onto the false seabed using cables and more water-filled tanks attached to the other side. The hull is currently resting on the false base at a depth of some 30 metres. The next stage is to release water from the crates which will provide the buoyancy necessary to refloat the wreck. It will then be towed to the port of Genoa and dismantled.